Hey guys, this is Kathy. Welcome back to my channel, Kathy's Favorite Things. You guys, I am joining in Lucia's open collaboration. It's hashtag WhatsApp Wednesday. And um, let me turn on the other ring lights that I have here. I have one more. There we go. Um, um, so I'm joining in Lucia's open collab for hashtag WhatsApp Wednesday. Um, I just wanted to um, update you on Augustine's health. Yesterday was Tuesday the 29th and Augustine had surgery at um, a local hospital here, Albany Med. And he had two surgeries actually, so he is going to be taking a little while to recover. He's still in a lot of pain and I am giving him pain medicine every four hours. I'm alternating between Tylenol and Motrin and just trying to keep him as comfortable as I can. I have him in a soft diet also, and he is in bed. So he is currently in my bed. No, Gio, get down. Hold on. Get down, please. Get down, get down. No. Um, so he is in my bed because he has um, a bunk bed and he cannot go up the stairs to his bed. Um, so he's sleeping with mommy and he's um, being taken care of. He's been given lots of love. Um, so yesterday I was supposed to do, um, you know, uh, an update video for a late Tea Tuesday, but it was impossible to do. Um, you know, we had to talk to a lot of family members to give Augustine's uh, health report we were exhausted we had to feed augustine feed ourselves and we ended up going to bed around 8 p.m last night so i'm sorry i did not get to do the late tea tuesday as i had planned i did uh, release a video that i had pre-recorded i have um, another dollar tree pre-recorded also so um, uh, you might see that tomorrow the day after um so yeah but uh, I still wanted to join in today and, you know, support uh, Lucia's Open Collab. Um, her channel name is Tiho Creates, so she's going to be the hyperlink in this video. Go check her out and follow the hashtag if you can. Um, a lot of people are joining in WhatsApp Wednesday, so thank you, Lucia, for the Open Collab. And I received... Um, a card from Caramia from Paper Confessions with Caramia's Corner, which is here. I already opened the side, so we're going to take it out and see what she sent. Oh, how beautiful. Look, it's a thank you card. It says thanks. Thank you, Cara. Oh, look, and she sent some um, stickers, I think. So cool. These are precious. How beautiful these are, super dainty and super delicate. I love those. And these are stickers, but they resemble like wax seals in stickers. Look how tiny and beautiful. And these are probably stickers also. I think so. Look at those. Very pretty. Thank you, Kara. And she's saying thank you for joining her challenge giveaway that she had. Oh, you're welcome. Thank you so much, um, Kara. She is um, hosting um, a swap at the moment and I'm going to be joining in that swap and I have to um, message back my swap partner. Um, I just saw her email so I had to respond to that. It's about the 80s and we're supposed to uh, decorate a binder which I hope to find that binder at Dollar Tree. I have not been at Dollar Tree lately so I hope to go maybe tonight when my husband comes home or tomorrow to see if I can find that binder because it's a Dollar Tree binder that I have to decorate uh, so yeah you guys what else um, I've been doing like I said not not this week but you know uh, the previous week I've been doing lots of shopping and I have not been um, recording much videos you know because Ala was leaving for Spain then I was prepping for Augustine surgery and homeschooling and all that so um but I have a couple of things that I have not opened or just one thing that I haven't opened here and it's a Halloween theme um 
and I'm gonna show it here because I know that Lucia loves Halloween. And this is from Target. I got a few things from Target. Um, they have some cool Halloween things. This was one of the things that I really, really liked. It's a jar. Um, let's see. It's a jar which you can put candy or whatever you want. You can even put it in like your bathroom and put cotton balls in it, whatever, you know. Uh, the cup is metal. Or you can also put candy in it, or you can put crafty supplies, you know, like black or red flowers, or you can put candy and keep it in your craft room. But I love it. I love that it's a uh, black, you know, because they had some other things, but I really like this one. This house, it has the kitty, uh, the fence and the bats, and it's super cool. So I got this from Target for $5. And I had to, of course, get this jelly bag. You saw this in, uh, <laughs> this thing is ginormous and it just on the way here, put it on the side. Uh, I got this jelly bag and they have this in different colors. They have it in purple and orange. And if you watch my shorts, um, you probably saw it. I really like the black one. The orange had a pumpkin, like a jack-o'-lantern, and the purple was a cat, but I really like the black one. And it comes with this uh, flag. It says to and from, and on the other side it says you've been booed. So you can definitely, you know, put candy here, different things, and gift it to someone. So it's a jelly bag, it has one bag and one flag, and this was $5 also from the Target dollar spot, you guys. So if you go to Target a lot, you probably saw it, and you um, most definitely, you grabbed some, because they are so amazing. It reminded me of when I was younger. You know, I had one of this on like, I don't know, different colors and I also had some shoes made of like the same material <laughs> when I was really young I remember um so you guys that's going to be my hashtag whatsapp Wednesday uh tomorrow we're going to be getting the winners for my hashtag for the love of packaging challenge my yearly challenge um so I will be getting a few winners uh, so stay tuned for that also tomorrow is supposed to be the reveal of what you made with your uh, hashtag ugly paper swap and my swap partner was annie from annie creates so i will be showing you what i created with the ugly papers that she sent me okay so make sure you check that out tomorrow and i hope you're having a fantastic day thank you so much for your prayers for Augustine. I greatly appreciate it and he does as well. He's not happy at the moment because he's in a lot of pain but I know that in the future he'll be happy. He had the surgery done. Now we are getting ready for the upcoming surgery which is going to be October the 25th and a little update on my son Ado. He's in Madrid, Spain. He already registered for his classes. He's going to start classes next Monday and he's adjusting to the change of uh, you know the schedule and the time difference and all of that. Um, so but he's happy. I asked him if he wanted to come back and he said no. <laughs> he said he was fine. So and he is sharing his location with me at all times which i did not request but he did on his own and uh, i'm happy to be able to see where he is you know i don't check all the time but you know sometimes i look and i can see where he is so that's fun as well okay you guys have a great day thank you for spending some time with me and have a great day or night okay bye now <laughs>